Hello everyone. In this lecture today, I'm going to talk to you about pharmaceutical calculations using allegation method. I'm going to show you multiple examples using allegation method. So uh, here I have shown the schematics of the allegation method. You put here higher concentration, here lower concentration, and in the middle required concentration, and on this side is required minus lower, and on on this side is higher minus required concentration. I will explain you uh, this method using multiple examples. Let's first talk about the first example. If you look at this question carefully, this question says how many parts of 20% weight by volume solution and 8% weight by volume solution is required to produce 16% weight by volume solution. So 20% is higher concentration and 8% is lower concentration and the required the, the solution that we are producing is 16% weight by volume so this is the required concentration right so we will just write it down so higher is 20% weight by volume and lower is 8% weight by volume and required is our 16% weight by volume okay so First, we have to note everything down, which is higher, which is lower, and which is the required concentration. Right. So after this, we, we use the formula. Formula is higher, lower, and in the middle you put required. And here is higher minus required. And on this side is required minus lower. Okay. So now we also have written down the formula. So I will just make the calculation now. So higher is 20%, so I will just write 20, and required is 16, so I'm just going to write here 16, lower is 8, I will write here 8, and so here, and here. So here, what you have to do, you have to require minus lower, right? So that means 16 minus 8, which is 8, okay? And here, this is the required, and this is higher, so the, this here we put higher minus required okay so here this arrow is down so higher minus required that is 20 minus 16 which is 4 so now the ratio of solution containing higher concentration is to lower concentration is you know look at this on top this is higher side so 8 8 and it it here is down lower side so here is to 4 right so 8 is to 4 for 8 is to 4, uh, we can divide this on the both sides by 4, so which means, which is uh, 2 is to 1. So to produce 16% weight by volume solution, we need uh, two parts, okay? We need two parts of 20% weight by volume solution, 20% weight by volume solution, and one part of 8% weight by volume solution, 8% weight by volume solution. Pretty easy, guys. I'm going to show you more examples. Another example is, question is, how many ml of drug suspension containing 80 mg per 5 ml and 42 mg per 7 ml is required to produce 500 ml uh, suspension containing 10 mg per ml? Okay, so first, we, we, we're going to make all this solution in one unit that is mg per ml okay let, let me do that first so 80 mg per ml it can be that means 80 mg per 5 ml so divided by 5 ml so it will be 16 mg per ml okay so uh, 16 mg per ml and here we have 42 mg per 7 ml so 42 mz per 7 ml that means divided by 7 ml this will be 7 6 of 42 so that means 6 mz per ml so from this this 16 mz per ml this is a higher concentration and 6 mz per ml this is a lower concentration right and so what is the required Required is 10 mg per ml. So required, required is 10 mg per ml. Okay. 
So now we have to use the formula. We know the formula is uh, here we put higher, here we put lower in the middle required, and then here is just uh, a required minus lower, and here is higher minus required. Okay? So we just put the numbers now for higher, we have 16 mz per ml. So 16 and for requ required concentration is 10 mz per ml because we are making 10 mz per ml uh, solution. So then 10 and the next is uh, lower concentration is 6 mg per ml. So I'm just going to put 6 here. And so here will be 10 minus 6 because it's uh, required minus lower. And here will be 16 minus 10. Right. So 10 minus 6, uh, this is 4. And 16 minus 10, uh, this is 6 here. OK, pretty simple, guys. So now the ratio of higher is to lower is, so this here, look at this, this, the value here for higher is 4, so that means 4 is to 6. So we can divide both these numbers by 2, divide by 2, 2, that means 2 is to 3. That means we need two parts of uh, the solution containing higher concentration, which means 16 mz per ml, and three parts of lower concentration, that means 6 mz per ml, uh, to prepare 500 ml of 10 mz per ml solution. Okay, But the question is not asking us the parts. question is asking us how many ml, right? So ml of, ml of uh, this 80 mz per ml solution or higher, higher concentration or which is uh, 16 mg per ml, ml of higher concentration. So how are you going to calculate? So how many parts of uh, this solution we need? We need two parts, so they, therefore we will put two on the top. Sorry, this is two. This is just two. Yes. And then, so in total we have two plus three, right? So the higher is two and lower is three. So two plus three in total five parts, okay? So this you will do. If you want to calculate ML of higher concentration, then you have to put the parts of higher concentration on top. And then you will uh, put this, you will add up these parts, 2 plus 3, so 5. Multiplied by, so what is the total, total ML of the required uh, solution? 500 ML, right? So then we will multiply by 500, okay? So this means that, so 2 times... 500 is 1,000 divided by 2 plus 2 plus 3 is 5. So this means 5 times 2, which means 200 ml. Okay, so we need 200 ml of higher concentration. That means 200 ml of 80 mg per 5 ml. Okay, solution. We need 200 ml of 80 mg per 5 ml. And if you want to calculate lower, you can do by two ways. One way is, you know the total, total solution we need is 500, right? And out of 500, a higher solution with a higher concentration, we need 200, so minus 200. So that means 300 ml, okay? 300 ml of lower concentration, so 300 ml of 42 mg per 7 ml. Or another way is similar to this higher concentration, what, what we can do, ml of lower this will be equal to the parts of lawyer. So we need three parts of lawyer. So three on top. And in the bottom, we have two parts of higher plus three parts of lawyer times 500. Why 500? Because 500 is the total ML of the required solution. So this gives us, so this becomes five. And so five and 500, so it, it is 300 ML. Okay, so pretty simple guys, right? So now, I'm going to show you another example. The question here says how many ml of 1 is to 20 uh, volume by volume solution of a drug can be prepared from 100 ml of 6% volume by volume solution. Okay. So look here. So the required what uh, so what what how much we have to how many ml of 1 is to 20 solution can be prepared. Okay. So what is the required? So in the question you should be able to identify which is required. So 
that means we have to prepare 1 is to 20 volume by volume solution so the required is 1 is to 20 or 1 is to 20 or simply we can also write this as 1 by 20 okay and if I want to convert it into percent and then I can multiply by 100 right so percent so it will be 5 percent okay so this is the required is 5 percent and uh, from 100 ml of 6 percent volume by volume solution okay so 100 ml of 6 percent volume by volume solution so then what is the higher concentration higher concentration is 6 percent but the lower concentration we don't know lower concentration we don't know so therefore we put zero okay so then we apply the formula our formula is higher required lower and here is uh, required minus lower and here is higher minus required right so then we put the values for higher concentration we have six percent okay six percent required is five right lower we don't know therefore zero why zero because we don't know the lower uh, solution with the lower concentration uh, so we don't know the concentration of the solution containing lower concentration that's why we put zero okay and now here becomes required minus lower that is five minus zero which is five and here is higher minus required that is six minus five which is one so then what is the ratio ratio of higher is to lower is five is to one that means we have to put five parts of higher concent solution with higher concentration five parts of solution with higher concentration and uh, yeah so five parts of solution with higher concentration and one part of solution with lower concentration okay so so it means that okay so question says how many ml of 1 is to 20 volume by volume solution of a drug can be prepared from 100 ml of 6 percent volume by volume solution so which means this 100 ml is equal to 5 part okay because this is the concentration for higher right so if 5 part if 5 part is equal to 100 ml this is 100 ml so how we know that 5 part is 100 ml because uh, we are preparing from 100 ml of 6 percent volume by volume solution that means one part will be 100 divided by 5 which means 20 ml right so but our solution in total our solution in total is five part plus one so six parts right so our solution in total is six parts okay so that means because this is five plus one total solution the required solution is six parts five plus one so that means for the six part how much it will be so that means 20 times uh, 6 so which will be 120 ml so how many ml of 1 is to 20 volume by solution can be prepared 120 ml of uh, the 1 is to 20 volume by solution can be prepared from 100 ml of 6 percent volume by volume solution okay we have different ways to make this calculation but I showed you a very easy example 5 part is 100 ml how we know because this 100 ml correspond to the solution containing higher concentration okay pretty simple guys pretty pretty simple I hope that I was able to explain you the allegation method uh, using different examples thank you very much